anyway, um, I wanted to come in right quick, and, uh, hold on, I wanted to do a video on, hold on, y'all, because I, I keep everything wrote down. a video about the shit that I don't like. I'm finna, this, this video is gonna be about that. It's gonna be a tag video because I had the stuff wrote down, but I didn't, I didn't have my phone available at the time, so I just went ahead and said some bullshit off the top of my head. Um, anyway, y'all, let's get started. I saw some other little tags I want to do, so, oh, I'm, not, I'm gonna try and squeeze them out here today. But on my other video, I think I said I don't like judgmental people. I don't like hypocrites. Uh, people who jump in front of me and drive slow and shit because, uh, hey, like I'm into drag races. So, see, a lot of times, yeah, I, I do drag race. So I do speed and all that type of stuff when I'm just out here on the road and whatnot. Um. But, hey, I'm safe with it. So. Don't need a motherfucking chimney in time. Oh, you not being so... Uh, yes, motherfucker, I'm, I'm safe. I know what the fuck I'm doing. Uh, Not having a parking spot. Okay. Like, when I go to Wildmore, I hate when... Like, everybody got their mommies at Wildmore, man. Because usually when I go to Wildmore, it's usually, like, at a certain time. I usually... Like, it depends on what's going on. But I usually try to hit Walmart, Walmart up, like, in the middle of the fucking night. But I know that people should be fucking asleep and shit. And it's not that crap. But God damn, man. Even when you go around, around about that time, shit, it's still hard to find a good-ass parking spot. Also, another thing with the parking spot, I hate, like, in my apartments, like, you come here and you think, okay, well, I'm finna park, you know, close to my door or somewhere like that. They got motherfucking mama, mama, T. Jones, cousin, Tito, Freddie Jackson, every fucking body is parked for one motherfucking person. And I'm like, man, what the fuck? And then I gotta try and park four off and shit. Some bullshit, man. That's why I say, I want me a fucking house. I'm getting tired of fucking apartments. Anyway, I know, y'all, y'all seen that little nigga come out. All these reality shows. What what happened to like Martin and and uh, the queen, uh, the king of queens, and uh, you know, just everybody loves Raymond. I mean, every time you turn on TV now, it's like I mean, the basketball wives, uh, the mob wives. You know, because I checked out. I think another video I said, you know, I had checked out Mob Wives Chicago. Just crazy, I mean, crazy, just all the fighting and shit. Uh, yeah, I'm just, I don't know, I'm just kind of getting, I, I, I've been kind of burnt out on uh, reality shows. <coughs> Excuse me. Men who cater, and I'm going to look at, look at the camera when I say this. Men who cater, and I will say that again, men who cater a lot. What I mean by that is when a motherfucker is always serving you up lies and for what? Especially when you ain't fucking asking for a lie. You know what I'm saying? I mean like for one instance um this dude I was dealing with. Now mind you I wasn't even looking for the motherfucker. It was over the weekend. And I didn't hear nothing from him. And me, I wasn't even fucking worried about the motherfucker. Monday morning, he called and I didn't answer the phone because I think I was busy doing some shit. He goes and calls my mom. My mom calls me and says, oh, such and such is looking for you. He wants you to answer the phone and all this and that. And I'm like, uh, you know, uh, okay, you know. It was just kind of weird to me. And then so when I talked to him... He was like, oh, you know, I'm, I'm sorry, I 
I didn't I didn't call you over the weekend or I was in jail. For real, motherfucker. Oh, you was in jail. Why are you giving me a fucking lie? I mean, I'm not even asking about what happened over the weekend. I didn't even bring the shit up. It was like that was the first shit that came up out of his motherfucking mouth. So I'm like, okay, you want me to you wanna cater me this motherfucking lie. And if you gonna cater me some shit, you better dress that shit up real nice. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay, he wants to tell me he's in jail. Okay, motherfucker. I'm finna play Inspector Gadget. So I called, did some calls. Mind you now, I know some niggas that work. I, I know some niggas that work at the jailhouse. You know what I'm saying? Go call. Check. This motherfucker ain't been in no fucking jail. Motherfucker. Stop catering lies to these motherfucking women, man. That's, that's some bullshit. And if you're going to cater a motherfucking lies, make sure the shit is, is well dressed. Okay. Not being up front. People who just cannot be up front with motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Be up front. You know, whatever you want, whatever you need, be up front. However you're feeling, be up front. Two faced motherfuckers can't stand that bullshit. You know what I'm saying? If you don't like me, hey, don't like me. But don't be coming and being out of my face. Oh, he, he, ha, ha. Oh, yeah, girl, you so pretty and all this snip. And then turn around and Susie Boo over here and be like, oh, that bitch think she all that. She ugly and all this snip. Miss me with that. Uh, People who drive slow, which y'all already know that. Uh, People who you just can't tell them shit. Like, I mean, they know every fucking thing. Men are probably the worst at this. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know some niggas, I can't, you can't tell them shit. Like, they just motherfucking King Joe. You know what I'm saying? You can't tell them nothing. With that Kanye West, you can't tell me nothing. And that's why I don't like him. Oh, let me see. Okay. <laughs> Nosy neighbors. <sighs> I told y'all before I stay in the apartments. These motherfuckers over here knows like motherfuckers. But, but let some bullshit happen. Let let my place get, get robbed or some shit. These motherfuckers ain't gonna know a motherfucking lick. But they can tell you who it came over here, what fucking time, what the fuck they left out of my apartment with, uh, what they fucking had on, what I had on when I was coming in last night. How my fucking hair was. You know what I'm saying? Shit, goddamn. How much fucking gas I got in my car because they can look out through my fucking car because my windows are not tinted. You know what I'm saying? Just nosy motherfuckers. Uh, niggas who think they are just a shit. Now, me, I'm going to give props where props are due. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm, I'm going to let you know, oh, you bad. Or you handsome and all this and that. There's nothing wrong with that. But don't let that shit go to your fucking head. Because like with me, I'm very humble. You know what I'm saying? Y'all yeah, have people give me compliments. You know, they like my hair or, or my makeup or, or something like that. Or they like my earrings or it just, you know, whatever. But don't let this shit go to your head. You know what I'm saying? And niggas got that real bad. Now, I'm not real for sure about females. But niggas got that shit real bad. I mean, they just think they just the, the motherfucking shit, man. You know, and that's one thing about me. I love giving, giving people compliments, you know what I'm saying? But stop thinking you the shit. Because you even got these ugly motherfuckers now. And they think that they, they are the shit. Okay, motherfucker, I'm just trying to help you along the fucking way. You know, I'm trying to build your character up a little bit. That doesn't mean take the bullshit that I'm giving you and run over the motherfucking fence and buildings and shit with it. You know what I'm saying? Calm the fuck down, shit. Anyway, yeah. Going off track. Uh, two more things and I'm done. And that is... Okay, y'all, this might get a little raunchy. Y'all already know how.
on my channel is men who nuts smell. What the fuck is going on with that? You know what I'm saying? But they want you to give them head and I like, okay motherfucker, I ain't I ain't putting shit off of my fucking mouth because this shit it smell foul. You know what I'm saying? But these motherfuckers, they always want to talk about how women are not smelling fresh. Okay, motherfucker, look at her. You need to go out in that fucking tub and soak in there real, real good. You know what I'm saying? Shit, put everything you can off in that bathroom. Vinegar, every fucking thing. Use some of my shit if you have to. You know what I'm saying? Lift the motherfuckers up and scrub. Scrub like there is no tomorrow. Seriously. Okay, another thing, last thing, uh, shit I can't stand. Niggas who just cannot, and I hope y'all can hear me on it, because I know my thing be real low. Let me pull the mic up here. Men who cannot eat pussy. I hope y'all heard me on that. Can I get an amen? Ones who cannot lick the pussy. And then the bad thing, they don't want you telling them shit. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, that's that's the shit that uh that I don't like. Uh you know, they can't eat the pussy and they don't want you telling them shit. They think they just know every funny thing. Susie Boo and Mary Jane, Mary Jane over there said that they can, so now can't no, nobody else tell them shit about it. <sighs> Motherfucker, you might as well get up, lift your fucking head up, and uh, go on and go on and go, because uh, uh, your, licking, your licking skills is not what that's at. But anyway, y'all, that's it for the, uh, the shit that I don't like to have. If you're watching this, your tag. Uh, probably wasn't too long for y'all. But anyway, y'all. Uh, that's it. I'm out. Kisses and deuces.